The solution consists of two easy steps. The first step is to delete user variables. To do this, we right click on the Windows icon and then click on System. Then, click on Advanced System Settings. After that, click on Environment Variables. If there is a Java option in the User Variables section, click on it and then click on Delete. The second step is completely uninstall and reinstall Java. To uninstall Java, we open our browser and type geek uninstaller in the search bar. I will put the geek uninstallers link in the description section. If you want, you can open the site from there. After opening the site, we click on download. Then we click on zip and then save. We close our browser and open our file. After doing this, we double click on geek. To find Java more easily, we type J in the search bar. We right click on Java and click uninstall. We click yes to continue. We have uninstalled Java. To reinstall Java, we open our browser and type download Java in the search bar. You can also find the link to Java in the description. After doing this, we click on the first result that appears. We click on download Java. We have downloaded Java. We double click on our file and then click on install. After the installation process is complete, we click close. Now you need to restart your computer. After doing this, you can check if the problem is solved or not. We have come to the end of the video. I hope this solution fixed your problem. If the video helped you, don't forget to like the video. You can also subscribe to my channel to support me.